Mira is an iPad app that gives you a window to see and interact with the objects in your Max patch. Mira also sends iPad information like multi-touch and motion. To get started, you'll need Max on your computer, Mira on your iPad, and Wi-Fi. Max should be at least version 6.1.3 running on Mac OS 10.6 or later. Download the Mira objects and documentation from the Cycling74 website. Then drag the Mira package into your Packages folder. If you're a Windows user, download the package from the same web page, where you'll also find an installation guide. Download and install the Mira app from the App Store. For Wi-Fi connectivity, you can use an external Wi-Fi hotspot. This network is named 1. You can also create a network using your computer as the hotspot. When you launch Mira, you'll see the name of the network. So far, there's no computer running Max on this network, so we don't see any server. Launch Max and create a new Mira.frame object. Now the iPad window shows what's inside the Mira.frame objects rectangle. New Max objects appear in Mira and can be operated from the iPad. Note that the Mira.frame object has a green indicator to show that it's connected to Mira. You can resize the frame to show more or less of the patch. Objects outside of the frame don't appear in Mira. You can add another frame to have another view of the patch, which appears as a new tab in Mira. This makes it easy to jump quickly between different parts of your patch, even inside subpatchers. By default, switching the Max patch from Patching View to Presentation View is visible in Mira. Clicking on the Max icon reveals Display and Configuration options, where you can lock Mira into Patching or Presentation. Or you can just have it follow Max. In the Object Explorer, Objects which Mira supports have a small M on their icon. Two of the Mira-enabled objects are especially interesting. Mira.multitouch receives multiple finger gestures from the iPad screen, and Mira.motion reports information about moving the iPad in space. Their help files include useful abstractions for analysis of this data. These can be a lot of fun to play with. Multiple iPads on the same network can control the same Max patch. Multiple computers on the same network can be controlled by Mira. Finally, in the Display and Configuration pane, you can disconnect each Max server. That's all you need to know to get started. The rest is up to you.